Hey, this is a uh, PGM 98387 coming to you from Spanaway, Washington. And I've uh, managed to uh, mount my three uh, Kyocera um, KC50Ts on, on a rail on my rack here on these uh, four rails, eight foot um, galvanized uh, perforated steel um, angle irons here. The size, the measurement of the holes actually matches the bolts. There wasn't, I didn't even need to drill any holes through my panels. Um, the holes actually matched up with these, uh, with, the, with the distance from one hole to the other. You can see there's no, I didn't have to drill any holes. So, and then the lengths of these wires are all identical and I measured them out. And then I did, actually I soldered them also along with just the other one I crimped, I didn't solder them, I need to go back and do that. And they're, Funny thing is, this is a this is a heavier gauge than this. This is a 12 gauge, and this is a 14 gauge wire. Maybe I maybe I messed up on that. But what I'd like to do is mount those um, the legs of the stand. Mount the legs of the stand on the um, on posts like that over there. So what I do is raise it up off the ground four feet, and then put a lag bolt through the to the base of the of these legs here. Put a lag bolt through through one of those on the um, base or on the the 4x4 four four post, pr uh, treated post. Then I can raise these off the ground. I'll do probably do the same thing to that one as this one. Yeah, it, was, it took me a, you know a day to do. These are these rated about Two and, a half, two and a half amps, it says there, so we got about five, seven, eight amps. Well, let's see, uh, maybe eight amps if I'm on a good day, if I have a lot of sun. I wired them up here. It's getting really crowded. I need to, I need to actually cut this in segments. And then once I have it in three segments, I can drill holes and use this as a bus bars for those for the for the ground and the positive negative wires that are coming. Those are all all three racks. It's that rack, that rack, and that rack all together coming in here. Right there, they're all joined together. Those on those bolts. Oh. I'm bringing in a couple amps. Oh, I don't have my macro on, so this 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 gauge is actually going to go in the house. I need to find some wire, old speaker wire, and I can mount this inside of my house so I know I know what my battery voltage is at. I don't have to come out here and and, and open the door and look. I'm leaving this on all the time now because it's summer and. Might as well have this on. See how many kilowatt hours have accumulated here on this. Oh, I've used 0.77 kilowatt hours. 50 cents. Anyhow, PGM 983 at 7 signing off.